Hi, and welcome to another, I don't know, one of my videos. So, uh, <laughs> I, I figured I'd make a quick video. Uh, not quick, actually, this time. I don't know if it'll be quick. Um, I know I always say that. So, anyways, um, I'm going to answer some questions that I've gotten. So, <clears throat> I have a list, um, and here's some things people ask me. Um, probably should have written down the name so I give credit, but you know who you are. Anyways, uh, an attitude you can't stand. Uh, I can't pe stand people who are constantly negative. It's annoying. <clears throat> or people that are constantly angry and stuff like that. You know, it's like, there's no need, you know. Uh, t what? I don't know why I'm answering this, but taste-wise, lobster or shrimp? Um, I'm a vegan, so neither. <laughs> uh, strangest pet you've ever had? Well, you choose. I've had a chicken, like a rooster, um, and it was in an apartment. I've had a pet, like giant moth. Uh, I had a pet lizard that I found outside. That wasn't really that weird, but um, probably the moth. I'm gonna go with the moth. Gotta be honest. Uh, favorite non-alcoholic drink? Um, I don't need to include that, but um, uh, I would. Perrier and coffee are the two. Th I water too, but Perrier or coffee those are my two favorite things. So, yeah, uh, celebrity you'd like to meet? My favorite actor is Jake Gyllenhaal, so probably him. I'm gonna have to go with Jake Gyllenhaal. Um, uh, you know, actually, Brian Molko. I, I think I would say the singer for Placebo. I'm gonna go with him because, like, you know, favorite band. And I mean, he's awesome, so, I mean, come on, you know. Uh, favorite classic rock band? Classic rock? Um, I'm gonna go with probably the Rolling Stones. I love them, you know. I like a lot of the old ones, but, yeah. I have to go with Rolling Stones, because they're just, I mean, you know, it's, you know, the thing, whatever. Um, dang, with the age difference, I'm not into it, you know, too much. If it's too much age difference, I ain't into it, to be honest. Um, my view on abortion, I think that people should not worry about what others do. I do think that you shouldn't be able to do it at nine months, like, you can. Or not, eight, uh, eight like, eight months, or whatever. Um, I think that's ridiculous, but I'm for it if this person wants it, you know. And I won't get too much into it, because I don't want to, like, get into a big argument, but I'm for letting the, I'm pro-choice. If the person needs, wants to get an abortion, and... It's reasonable time, let them do it. It's none of your business whether that happens or not, you know. I mean, I, I saw this thing the other day. It was like, you're, uh, if you're so worried about me uh, going against God's will, about you having a, me having an abortion or whatever, you know, then you should think twice or whatever because uh, you using a condom is going against God's will too, isn't it? So, whatever, you know. Take that as you want. Um, I'm pro-choice, definitely. How tall are you? I'm 6'3". Uh, do you think you're attractive? I don't know. You can tell me that. <laughs> I, I'm not going to judge myself. Uh, uh, my favorite book and favorite author. Favorite book is Catching the Rye, but I read The Rules of Attraction recently and Lesson Zero, and those are awesome. I love those. So, those are close. Um, and then, uh, favorite author is probably, gosh... It's either, Ch I love Charles, D let me name some few that I like. I love Charles Dickens, I love J.D. Salinger, you know, Catching the Rye, obviously. Um, uh, those books I just mentioned, Less Than Zero and Rules of Attraction, they're by an author called uh, um, Brett Easton Ellis, and I love him. He's an awesome author, I'm actually reading a book by him right now, too. Um, so, you know, go with that. Favorite animal, uh, my cat. <laughs> Full name is... Jesse, Joseph, Burke, cats or dogs? Okay, I love both. I love animals, but I have a cat, so I'm going to go with cats. Um, because it's my cat. I don't have a dog, I have a cat, so I'm going to go with cats. And people that know me are going to be like, make fun of me, oh, of course you choose cats, because I have this thing that, you know, I'm like obsessed with cats, which is kind of true, but whatever, you know. Do you have any gay friends? Yes, of course I do. I express my views on 
not let him get married, stupid. Um, are you embarrassed of your teeth? Uh, now, honestly, yes, I did choose the question I'm answering, but okay, am, I, am I embarrassed of my teeth? No. Not to sound egotistical or anything, but I take really good care of my teeth, so, you know, my teeth are great. See? Uh, they're, I don't know if you see anything, but they're very white and everything. Well, I don't want to get into, oh, but I take really good care of them, and so I've earned saying that I have good teeth. Plus, I have them anyway, so. Uh, yeah, favorite actor, I already answered that, it's Jake Gyllenhaal. Uh, name one of your phobias. I'm scared of, like, really deep water that I can't see in. I don't know what it is, but really deep water I can't see in is scary, even sometimes, like, really deep water. Um, you know, like, deep lakes, and they're dirty, and when they're dirty and stuff, ugh. Bogs, ugh. Um, yeah, so, they're, that's scary to me, you know, it would take too long to explain the whole thing of what I am scared of with deep water and what I'm not. Um, finally, oh yeah, do you ever wear sunglasses? Um, I've been wearing them the whole time I made this video, so if that doesn't answer your question, then yes, I do. Actually, I wear them all the time. So, answered a few questions, and hope you like it. Alright, bye. Ow. Bye.